Warning, known bad CPU. Oh, okay. Oh, Intel. Oh, come on. Damn it, Intel. You just... Unbelievable, dude. Intel. Freaking ruin everything for everybody, dude. Uh, hey, RS fan. This is the hit game Ashes of Creation. We just wanted to let you know that your CPU f***ing sucks. <laughs> we hope you enjoy playing our game on your sh piece of sh dog sh ass CPU. <laughs> God help me. Thanks, Ashes of Creation. Thank you. Thank you for the dono. Hmm. Hmm. What is the most paladin y? Tank, cleric? Melee cleric isn't much of a thing yet. Really? Hmm. Live your dream as a bard? With their mesmerizing melodies, peerless pantomime skills, and wondrous weaving of soul-stirring tales, bards leave a lasting impression on a friend and foe alike. Yeah, I'm on Lineth. Ah, uh, maybe I go, maybe I do bard. Do we, do we hit the bard? Lineth Tech Thip. Yeah, I'm playing on Lineth server. I mean, I think how I normally play games, Fighter is my guy, but man, Bard just seems fun. Like, Bard seems like Goofy, it'd be funny. Hey there, this fan. This is the hit game Ashes of Creation. We just wanted to let you know that the Bard class f***ing sucks. <laughs> we hope you enjoy playing our game with your shitty <laughs> piece of shit class. God f***ing help me. <laughs> uh. Hey, you know what? That's good because I'm used to it. Okay, chat, we're going bored. We're going bored. Okay, guys, here's what's important. We all know the truth. Uh, complete and total uh, character immersion. You have to become one with your character, okay? Body shape, height, max weight, max chest, max arms, max legs, max. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Muscle tone zero. This is muscle tone zero. Wait, that's crazy. The wrinkles actually like it, 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 he actually does look old and young. That's actually crazy. The the aging actually is uh, noticeable. Hello, S fans community. The game you are looking at right now is officially not released yet. Keep in mind. You need to pay us your weekly food money to get in. True. Just take a small loan of a million dollars to get in. <laughs> and, uh, happy gaming, folks. <laughs> hey, yes, fan. This is the brand new hit game, Ashes of Creation. Just letting you know that bard, cleric, mage, fighter all fucking suck. And you will have to roll a tank in order to be invited to end game sweaty sweat sweat groups. Have fun. Classic, dude. Hey, in Intrepid, if you're watching, let me make my thighs bigger. Like, look, dude, I got... Okay. I'm just gonna keep it real. Look. Hello? Like, I got... You know what I'm saying? Like... You got, you got Arnold Schwarzenegger on top and Asmongold on bottom. You know? Ah, uh, S-Fan, the level one bard. Bard is so soy. <laughs> it's time to play the game. Sir, okay. Did you get all that intrepid? Make Arnold have sex with Asmund. Thanks for coming. Welcome to phase one of Alpha 2 on Vera. Thank you for joining us, adventurer. This version of Ashley Christian you're about to experience is a work in progress. It's a slice of the game, which has a fair amount of bugs you may experience. Our main goal for this phase is to test scalability, testability, uh, availability, and adaptability. Also, stability, core loops, in our gameplay, squash bugs, iterate on feedback provided by the community, and find fun. Uh, beyond that, it is to ensure that the download and login process is in a good state, leading up to our upcoming testing phases with wider audiences, which will then lead into Beta 1, where we'll focus on balance and polish. Uh, we will be adding content throughout the phases of Alpha 2, and as we do, you will help us test that content. Sick. 
Uh, if you have time to provide feedback or share bugs, you can do it on the forums. Sick. Dude, it's Sea Dank. Uh, Word of Rock. It's DJ Penguin. Oh, frick. I just typed that slash S. How do I talk? Hi. Okay, wait, so I have a heal, quick wit. Jest with target ally, healing for 150% of your, I don't know, spell power stat. And healing and apply glee. You ridicule, or you can use it to attack an enemy, ridicule the target enemy, damage them for 100%, bludgeon damage, and applying demoralized. Okay, it's definitely a little laggy. Let's take a look at what else. Guard, no valid weapon, sprint. Dude, look, I'm almost as fast as I am in real life. Speed. Dodge. Uh, what is this? What's the cool for this? Left shift? Uh, of control? Oh, insufficient stamina. Where'd your hair go? I put it in a ball in my hat. Uh, book combo attack. Keeping the gate weaker's watch is uh, staying exhausted quickly. Okay, let's leave. Sorry, just playing some ashes of creation. <laughs> Thank the gods you've arrived safely. Oh, please hold your applause, m'lady. Disorientation upon arrival to the world of Vera is natural. You're feeling the flow of essence for the first time. Essence is the very energy of creation. It flows throughout Vera, into us, and provides great power. Ooh. How you choose to cultivate that power will determine your destiny. You'll have plenty of time to discover that on your own. For now, I'm playing a bard because there's there's no paladin. Lionhold, the settlement just west of here. But keep that weapon at the ready. Guys, yeah, it's this is a very, problem. very early alpha. Disgusting creatures. Like memes aside. Cut them down if they cross your path. Like of course there's gonna there's gonna, there's gonna get a lot of bugs. Present it to any welcome official in Lionhold. Be on your way. Uh press I to open inventory. Gateway medallion. Is that like your hearth? Oh, rations. Oh, wasted. Uh, okay. Chat, you got to appreciate how long it took us to fix this. Combine tank and clear your paladin. Well, there's the no subclass in this thing. In place. We had the pay thing set up perfectly. To give you the real alpha experience, we had them run in place. Didn't they say there's no Chat subclasses in this, uh, in this alpha? Oh, frick. That's right, bitch. Wait, I don't have a, I don't have a weapon. Hey, I don't have a weapon. Welcome to Vera. Optional, the gateway sentry. Guard wizard. Your weapon is music? I think I just threw a tomato at this guy. Oh, because he plays music bad. I got it. Makes sense. Where's the action bar? It's right here. For now. Is book oh book combo? Hyper combo. Makita? Dude, I can't think of Makita without thinking of uh, that that one clip, the Miyako clip. You're a new face around here. Welcome. Do you have your gateway medallion? <laughs> this guy's voice. Why, yes, I do. Wonderful. I'm permitted to offer you a small care package on behalf of our glorious empire. Before I do that, however, I must ask you to visit our Ember Spring. Uh, I will do so. I don't know what the Ember Spring is. Okay, um, you know what I need to do? Let's go to settings, HUD editor. Oh. Uh, let's go to game options. I think I need to make the UI a little bit bigger. Am I getting old? I used to make my UI as small as possible in WoW. Really cool class, biggest fan. You're gonna Strong return your little magical book to the library for some XP. That's what Fucking nerd. Thank you, thank you, Dagoth. 
Okay, the gateway sentry asked me to slay some sickly goblins on the way down. Uh, the sweat of your brow. Learn what you can learn what you can working for the United Trades folk in the lion hole. Uh. Thank you for participating in our Alpha 2 first phase. To continue the testing, please transfer 500 more dollars for four WoW mounts. Thank you for your service and God bless America. Thank you, Mr. President. Yeah, I know. I wish I wish there was a paladin that I could play now, but uh, I think Bard will be fun. I mean, it's just alpha, right? Uh, learn what you can working with the United Tr uh, Trades Book and Lions. Oh, dude, this is pure cinema right now. Wait, actually, this does look pretty good. Oh, wait, there's a. Oh, oh. General action bar? General action bar? Man, I can't wait to get off my shift to try out Ashes. They stuck me on drive through duty again, and I got yelled at for forgetting a customer's fries. <laughs> I fucking catered here. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I don't really care how it looks um, that much. For me, art style is what matters, not a, uh, like, Graphical fidelity, I guess. Uh, wait, where's my beard? Wait, where'd my beard go? And my hair? Someone shooting a gun? Deer. Requires apprentice hunting certification. I healed it. Oh, this looks like shit. Guys, have you guys ever played like MMOs? This, this looks like every other MMO whenever, whenever you first play. Like level one of a new MMO is, is, this, is this is like what the game is like. You kind of run around, and you have no idea what's going on. It's just normal. Guys, it is alpha. It's going to be buggy. They keep saying, like, look, it's buggy. We, we want people to have a chance to play it so we can get feedback from them and help uh, make the game better. Chatters also forget that a span has crippling HDMI, so he's going to run around even more. Wide hardo. Wide I'm sorry, but I'm going to say what everyone else is thinking. In RuneScape, I'd already be killing rats and buying wives in trade chat. I bet you can't even kill a fucking rat in this game. Complete dog shit. Ossers is the best MO ever. Paid for by Volt. True. As man, can you please get me a key? Wait, do you not have a key? Dude, chat, this is cl dude, classic, dude. And, and, and everybody's in dire str uh, S fan, come save the day, dude. Just typical, typical day will, dude. Uh, since apparently you're the one that fixes everything and saves the day, can you come help my parents get a divorce so I can have two Christmases? <laughs> two Christmases, let's go! <laughs> okay. Activate Ember Spring. I'm attuning, I'm attuning. I can't believe this game oh. is five seconds old and already needs a key. This is some bullshit. Come on, chat. Let's make it a fucking Toontown online guild and fucking save Toontown. <laughs> if you want to join my group, you better make sure you have your level one rat orange parses. This game's been out for 52 minutes. Why don't you have your parses yet? I think Schlatt actually walked in on his fan at tuning his essence once, and that's why he doesn't live there anymore. <laughs> what? It's a normal thing, dude. Everybody's attuning their essence. Uh, the gateway sentry asked me to slay some sickly goblins. Chopping trees on the king's land without a license is against the law and punishable by a 500 gold fine or hung by the penis until dead. <laughs> Thanks, hey, Adam. Buddy, I'd like to give you this package. I really would, but I need you to attune to a spring. Take your clothes off and I'll get that package ready for you. I'll just be over here, attening my shit. Straight essence. Okay, let's go kill these goblins. Your character shit his pants? Yeah. You shit in game, you shit in real life. That's why my pants are full of poop right now. Oh look, I'm, I'm hitting him with a book. I'm hitting him with a book. So, so is book my auto attack? Oh no, no, I, I just spam the book all the time. Okay.
I gotta save this guy. I'm booking it. I'm booking it. Okay. So, uh, book combo. One hit one hits for 58 arcane damage. Bounces to three enemies. Hit two does 66. And then the finisher does 82. Oh, so, I, like, a bard has, like, a big cleave with a book. Oh, dude. I'm free. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Look at the big cleave. Dude, I'm owning. Yeah. Dude, the page master. If you like killing goblins, I've got a mind goblin you can kill. Mind goblin these nuts. Fucking got him. Thank you. Dude, I'm giving them all paper cuts, dude. Oh, you know what? Dude, you know what I've gotten recently, man? Have you guys ever gotten a paper cut from the, the brown paper bag Amazon packages? Like, it's like brown paper bag Amazon mailers. If you order guys, something from guys, Amazon, like guys, a wire, this is the real killer for real. It's this brutal. Time. They are brutal, dude. It's like a very thick, strong paper. Thanks, Grayson. Thank you for the dono. Hey, Laris fan. This is the Eight Game Ashes of Creation. We just wanted to let you know that your skin's durability fucking sucks. We hope you enjoy playing our game with your piece of shit shit task skin durability. God fucking help me. <laughs> you there, help us retake the wilds. Sure. Quest giver. Harold Harold. Is a Harold named Harold? You're a newcomer, eh? Well, there's no better way to find your feet than a odd jobs the townsfolk around the outpost need doing. They bring them to me and I post them on the board. Used to do them myself when I was a spry young soldier. This was back on Sanctus, of course. Oscar voice acting. Chat. Voice acting cinema. Hello there, S-Fan. This is the hit game, Ashes of Creation. We just wanted to let you know that we just wanted to too. We just wanted to let you too. We just... Bloody two war. Being in this allowed the night, otherwise, there I know I don't want to I was just barely. What the hell, Adam? It's good. Fuck, 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 fuck. Goblins got into the E. coli onions and now we need to kill them. You there. Yeah, you with the you book. There. I need you to Check take out that, that book and handle this. No one can know we committed war crimes this early. Just take the book, kill them. Sick. I got a, uh, I got the wood. Objective complete. I got the wood. This game plays Adam so far. Sweat off your brow. Have you brought the it's I have the wood. Yeah, okay, give him some wood. I blah blah blah. Okay. Deliver cargo to the storage clerk at any crossroads or higher level node. Do you wanna know my honest my honest opinion about movement in MMOs? And, and I'm a big believer in, like, you can't really beat WoW by trying to be WoW. Right? Like, trying to make a WoW clone, like, you're never gonna, you're never gonna, like... Like, you can't make a WoW killer that is just WoW. Because then people are like, well, why would I go play that when I go play WoW? But, what I do think that they should try and copy WoW, I think every MMO should just take WoW's movement. Because the biggest thing that, uh, like, the biggest barrier of entry, or like the... I just like, the first, like point of uh, exposure for any game that you're ever going to play is how your character moves. And if people are playing a new MMO and there's a lot of uh, there's, there's a lot of different movement mechanics than what they're used to it makes them feel uncomfortable. It's crazy that everyone says this yet no dev does it. I don't know why. Cause like I, I don't think uh, I don't think that like this is like jump and then you can stop mo your momentum and turn like Dark Age of Camelot had this I I didn't like this like if you jump you should you should keep jumping at that speed in that direction you know the the movement the uh, motion still should still go there I build on Throne and Liberty because of the movement yeah like how smooth the game feels to play is like the first thing. Have you a 
let it be known that even as we have you a to excellent have you a excellent let it be known that even as we struggle to maintain our foot let's give it a new quest our cool. glorious empire still cares have you here are your supply of dreadful that's just wild brain rot i think it's like that for every game like for example I think one of the biggest reasons why, uh, well, there's a couple reasons, but one of them, uh, one of the reasons that PUBG and Fortnite, like Fortnite won the, won the arms race against PUBG was because the game ran so much smoother than PUBG did. PUBG was like clunky, weird, like you're like moving in molasses. Now I loved PUBG, I prefer PUBG, but there's a reason why Fortnite won out over it. The same thing goes for Dota and League, right? Dota plays smoother than League does. And and because of that, the barrier of entry is lower. What do you think of Overwatch movement? Uh, I haven't played Overwatch in so long. You know what's crazy? I've kind of had this Overwatch itch. I was watching Overwatch clips and I was like, I should play Overwatch again. I probably, I would probably install it, play it one time, and be like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> That's probably Chat. what will happen. You pay one hundred dollars to support being the development smooth. of the game, Blizzard in and general then they really give you that. access to play the alpha. You are supporting the active development and not paying directly for access to the alpha. Almost all games do this for early access. Thank you, Twoot. I feel like they do need to do something to give this a little bit more artistic flavor and make it stand out a little bit more. I would rather be stuck in a running animation than riding a dragon in retail inspired from a show from Disney Channel or doing 35 million damage in one spell. <laughs> Indefinitely not a classic Andy Hayton, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Uh, yeah, I think it needs a little bit more. It, it needs something. Uh, and that was a feedback that I had, I believe, a few years ago, actually. I'm starting to remember. Uh, I do think it doesn't look bad, but for example, you take a game like WoW. You pay $100 to support the development of a game you like. I pay $100 so I have a reason to be pissed off and hate everything. We are not the same. <laughs> yeah, I, I think people like talking about game looks like, anytime people are talking about graphics of the game and say, they say like, oh, this looks like it came out this many years ago. It's like, ah, like, that's not what it's about, man. Like, it's, it's, it comes down to art style. And for me, I think generally hey, like- TTS monster here. Can you guys disable Adam? A bunch of other streams are asking why he sounds so sassy and we think we've figured it out. It's you. It's this fucking chat. Stop using Adam, please. His model costs so much we can't have it go bad. He That's how it goes. All these things, all these different games have like a unique look to them, right? Um, well, I think the ones that really stand out and are memorable have like a very unique look to them, right? Like WoW is like very cartoony. And I remember whenever WoW came out and I, I played Dark Age of Camelot and Dark Age of Camelot Catacombs had just come out. So let me do this, Dark Age of Camelot Catacombs. And I remember at the time that Catacombs had come out, they did a big graphics update. They overhauled the, the entire graphics. Okay. So they, they upgraded the graphics, right? And they look like this now. This is cool. And I remember whenever this came out, whenever this came out, I was like, man. Wow, it looks cartoony and stupid. This looks way better, way more realistic. But WoW looks cartoony and stupid. 
But now... If there's one thing I can say for certain from watching this stream, it's that I'd rather watch Grayson run around Stormwine for eight hours trying to find people to carry him in me than this scuffed-ass proof of concept a couple of students would put together over a Strelt board. Weekend, I'm dead. which somehow took a whole team eight years and millions of dollars to cobble together. Oh, shut up, Naps. Okay. Uh... So the main thing here is this picture versus, you know, these, right? These, these different models. 20 years ago, I was like, oh, this looks way better than this. But as time has gone on, the thing that made WoW really stand out was that art style. Even though the graphics were like bad for vanilla compared to the other MMOs at the time. Look at Guild Wars 2, look at Dark Age of Camelot. Look at all these other MMOs that were like realistic. They were trying to look like realistic. They aren't super memorable. Even Final Fantasy XIV has a little bit of that, but I want to take it a step further. Final Fantasy XIV has like a lot of like very iconic looking armors, characters, and uh, the monsters especially. So Final Fantasy XIV has that somewhat kind of medieval, quote, realistic type of look, but it also has its own art style at the same time. And I think that they can hit that with this. I just don't have the answer. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very, yeah, Final Fantasy XIV is extremely stylized and artistic in a very distinct way. I agree. Uh, while still also kind of having that more realistic look that I would typically say looks not that great. Because, it, not that it doesn't look great, it doesn't survive, it doesn't last the test of time. It doesn't withstand the test of time because if you try and make anything look realistic, like newsflash, making anything look realistic, your graphics will get outdated eventually. You can outdate graphical fidelity, you can't outdate an art style. If something looks good, it will always look good. I like the scenery off in the distance. I will say this, I think like, I think this is beautiful, by the way. I think, I think the, the image of like, uh, when you look off in the distance, it looks very cinematic. Like, I, I actually love that. Like this, I think is wonderful. Seeing shit in the distance gives so much depth. Yeah, I agree. I feel like they need iconic armor sets for it to be, oh yeah, that armor set is definitely from Ashes of Creation. Mm. Yeah, that's uh, that's one thing. I, yeah, that's probably right. The tradesman everyone is Mining tool station. See, I wish it would show me. I wish it would mark on the map where the mining, okay, there it is, right here. Yeah, I think, I think they need to make the font a little bit better to read on the health bar. A book? You are a bard, start to sing. Where is the drums and the fur box? Dun, don't tell me what to do is fanned. I'll do whatever the frick I want. I have to swim to a sea. But I am all the way in and a certain in the mountain. Are we really there? Yeah, man, 100%. Thanks for the entertainment. I heard you have recently developed a sweet tooth. Uh, yeah, I, I'm. I'm for the I think I finally tomorrow. got rid of it. Let's Thank you, though. Go. Yeah, tailgate tomorrow is going to be great. Yeah, I'm going to Wisconsin. I'm going to the University of Wisconsin tomorrow for tailgate. We do IRL Saturdays, but right now we're doing tailgate tour. So University of Wisconsin tomorrow with Extra Emily is going to be really good. Yeah, we're going to have a good time. The, uh, if you haven't seen the tailgate streams, you can uh, see them on my YouTube. Deliver the cargo to a storage clerk at any crossroads or higher level node. So I was lost a lot of weight. Yeah, I did. Not too fast. It was uh, it was over the course of almost two years now. But I, I I just weighed myself earlier. I'm 235. I started at 310 pounds in like March, like end of February, March, April, like that that region, that area of time. It was after I tore my tricep and hurt my neck. 
I tore my tricep and hurt my neck back to back, and I'm like, okay, I, I'm, I, I have to stop trying to exercise, stop trying to work out, and I just have to diet and and not get hurt. I just need to diet and heal. That's all I need to do. Can you put what you said about your weight loss? Uh, I started at 310 pounds uh, in like February, March, April, like that region of time. I, I hurt my neck. Or I tore my tricep and then I hurt my neck, like back to back. And this was probably like almost a year after I broke my thumb. And I had another thing going on in between that. So like, I just, I was like, boom, 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 injury, 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 injury. And when I, when I tore the tricep and hurt the neck, I was like, I gotta, I gotta take time to heal and figure it out. I have to stop exercise, stop lifting weights. I'm only making things worse. Uh, and I just focused on what I ate for a while. Uh, is stream getting screen tearing? It's probably because I turned off, uh, if you turn off vertical sync, I, like, the streamer might not get stream, screen tearing, but the, uh, the viewers will. That's why, that's why streamers turn on vertical sync a lot of times. Game looks very alpha. Yeah, I mean, it is, it is. And they're, they're super public about it, right? Oh, look, it's Sardarko. Yeah, what's up, dude? What the hell? Oh, it's Jobek. Oh, I got my first level, by the way. Ooh, level. Wait, so what? at what level do you choose your skills? Excusing me, Alpha is not okay there. You'll start Alpha. What is wrong with you? What, it's, man, it's, it's so hard to, like, talk to gamers. Because, like, on one hand, like, on one hand, like, you'll get somebody that's, like, just totally normal and... and like understands how things work and there's somebody else who's like they they're upset because they're like mom made them eat brussels sprouts you know what i mean <laughs> like come on man <laughs> like, uh choose a skill instrument flute passive effect ooh Oh, hold on. What should I be? Should I be a drummer, a fiddler, or a fluter? Leave the Brussels sprouts out of this, buddy. It's not, yeah, exactly. It wasn't eight years of alpha. It's like, and also it's like, not like this specific build has been, it's an MMO. MMOs take forever, man. Like, P Diddler, okay. We're not, okay, we're not going fiddle. Uh, okay, we're on drum then. Okay, flute and fiddle are both, yeah. But can I respect- See, this is the problem with streamers nowadays. They are so out of touch. They have no idea how fucking bad Brussels sprouts are. Uh... Okay, oh, menacing melody? Cathartic melody, cheerful melody, pensive melody, and epic melody. Do these change? Okay. Let's go flu- we'll do all of them. Uh, menacing melody. Nearby party members gain menacing melody, damage multiplier. Ooh, 10% more damage to the whole group. Let's go. Um, cathartic. Nearby party members gain cathartic melody, or attacks by 20%. Heal yourself. Ooh. Okay. What? 25% chance for 50% lifesteal? That's crazy. Uh, nearby party members gain cheerful melody. Healing received increased. Oh, healing received buffed. Okay. It also has a passive heal. Uh, nearby party members gain pensive melody. Restores mana. Okay. Nearby party members gain epic melody. Movement speed increase. Ooh. And stamina regen. Oh, so move speed and sprint. You, you would sprint, you'd get that stamina regen. Like we used to do, we used to have two guys in a... When we would PvP, when we'd do RVR in Dark Age of Camelot, you would have your uh, speed buff guy, your speed aura, and then your stamina aura guy. And then you would sprint with it. And you keep your everything up. It was sick. Uh, I think we go for the big dam. Okay, where'd they go? P 
Pipa flute. Oh no. The frick did I? What the heck? You guys have bar tuned out? Yep. Can you hear that? Oh, Shobik died. He's <laughs> 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 just dying of like, I'm like dancing on his body playing a flute. <laughs> Hell in this game, oh, you know, where you can do a thing uh, that, oh, you know, was totally different than eh, anything than it's called. He called it the, you know, request. The, the Is quest, there a way they can True. Dude, that was freaking funny. Uh, hi. Can you hear my flute? Is it annoying? Awesome. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if they'll change that. Yeah, and maybe just stick to Paladin. Anytime you stray from the light, you become an asshole playing the Pied Piper. Oh, no, 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 kill me, no, kill me, no, kill me. Corpses. You know what? Deserved. I'll, I'm taking that one. Yeah, I like, deserved. Deserved. I can't lie. Deserved. Harvest wilted snowdrop. Yeah, it was, uh... It's about a year and a half. Oh, dude, I never even finished what I was saying earlier. Uh, the biggest piece of advice I could give if people want to lose weight, like I said, just eat less forehead. It's actually like remove the sauces from from food or like butter. You you get you go to Chick Fil A. You want to get a sandwich? Just say, hey, I don't want any butter or anything on the bun. Like stuff like that adds up so much because if you just like go 500 calories a day, or sorry, if you're in a 500 calorie deficit. Or de de deficit. <laughs> I'm, I didn't sleep last night. Um, if you're in a 500 calorie deficit, then uh, that isn't <laughs> that is enough for you to be able to lose like a pound a week on average, roughly. Didn't sleep, dude. I was scared I was gonna miss launch, and then it got delayed. Can you believe that? Or like In N Out, McDonald's, all that stuff. Like no Big Mac sauce. Uh, in N Out, no no In N Out sauce. You know, no no In N Out spread or whatever they call it. Yeah, no, that is that is the strat. That's the way to that's the way to do it. Um, uh, hey, give me a moment here. I need to uh. That is definitely one strategy. Personally, I find being horribly depressed helpful. 